David Sorensen, once a senior advisor to Governor LePage and a speechwriter for President Trump, talks with News Center about abuse accusations. Good evening. I'm Pat Callahan. And I'm Cindy Williams. Sorensen says he never physically abused ex wife Jessica Corbett. But he resigned Friday after a White House official said they learned of Corbett's accusations. Since then, the couple have gone on record, each claiming they were physically abused by the other. News Center's Dustin Vladkowski has been following this story for us. And what is the couple saying now, Dustin? Well, Pat and Cindy, David Sorensen says he plans to sue his ex-wife for defamation. He told us that today after three days of what he says are false accusations. His ex-wife, Jessica Corbett, refused to comment on what Sorensen told us, saying his lies only made her more afraid of him. Both Sorensen and Corbett did agree, however, on one piece of information. Their marriage was not a happy one. Uh, I will readily admit our, our marriage was a disaster. David Sorensen opens up about leaving his job at the White House after he made national news, accused by his ex-wife Jessica Corbett of physically and mentally abusing her. Sorensen says he was never physically violent with his ex-wife. We fought all the time. Um, I certainly um, said some things that I, that I never um, have said to anybody before. So. That, that happened for sure, but it was never physical on my part. Sorensen told us what he said to his ex-wife was no worse than anything she said to him. He insists he did not cross the line into what he considers violent behavior. We need to be very careful and, and make sure that um, we remember that violence is physical. However our bad our fights got, there was no power imbalance. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. News Center Maine reached out to Corbett today, but only got her voicemail. She did reply to a text from us saying she won't respond to what she calls Sorensen's lies. Corbett also told us she stands by her previous statements about Sorensen, including him running over her foot with a car. Sorensen says no one should believe those claims, and everything his ex-wife is doing is an orchestrated effort to destroy his reputation. One of the reasons why I was uh, why I hesitated to. Um, to file for divorce was because I was concerned that she would do exactly what she's done right now, which is publicly lie about me and smear me and hurt my career. And we did ask both Sorensen and Corbett if they plan on filing defamation lawsuits against each other. Sorensen again told us today that he does plan to do that. Pat and Cindy and Corbett declined to comment on that question. Thanks, Dustin, Dustin, thank you so much.